Uh, so I'm moving, I'm moving to Houston because that's where my wife is right now. And they get paid even better than there from what I've seen. That's it's really nice. All right, so jumping in this match, Brahman or Sonito doing the, uh, <laughs> the Sonic special running behind you in the side beam. It's a thing. Like, I thought only Sonito did it, and then I saw 6WX do it. And I'm like, oh, I'm sure good. So, <laughs> so one thing, I, I, I haven't seen Big Ox play since the Arcadian, I don't think. Really? I mean, got maybe, a lot better. Maybe once or twice, and, and I, I know he's leveled up a lot, so yeah. I, I, I'm really I'd excited say, to see this match. I'd say he's definitely even on Kid Carlton's level. That's really good. Now, Kid Carlton always wins between the two of them, but I think that's because of the differences in style. Yeah, yeah. Big Ox is a very error-oriented Mario. And he really likes uh, right. getting those uh, spikes and exactly. hype, hype breeds and, and stuff. I think that's going to hurt him in this matchup because yeah. Sunita's not going to fall for that. Oh. oh. He went a little too low yep. there. Yeah. Thought your jump. He should just upbeat early. It would have gone through the spring. Anyway, so uh, Sunita taking that first stock pretty solid. Yeah. And then just kind of run around doing Sonic stuff. That's looking for it. <laughs> you, you know he was already looking for yes. that BDI out of yes. that is that is one thing. So even if Big Ox gets down low, one one uh, spike is going to turn him on, and he is going to get hype. Oh yeah, but he's been playing phenomenal this uh, second stock. Yeah, he's, yeah. That, that's the first hit Sonito's gotten in. Oh, uh, a little late on the episode yep. there, but I like the idea. It, exactly. Nice. That's the thing about Sonic. The character's on the ground. He's going to get to where he needs to be to punish you. I don't care where you are. <laughs> really fast. I'm on the other side of the stage. Sonic can't get me a sight. I want to see. I'm right here, fam. I want to see if uh, Big Ox gets any of the uh, the jab blocks that Mario can get because those are really fun. Oh yeah. But so far, this is really good by Sonito being uh, just all around confident in what he's doing and not really. Oh, so that was your up smash. That yeah. Was your up yeah. Like most Mario's actually start looking for that jump option to up smash him. Nice. Yep. Good up air. Good follow. I, I would like to see him uh, get that up B to the follow. Try and follow one more time off the top. But. And back air. Not yeah, going to get it. Yeah, just holding on to the stock right now. Big Ox is on the offensive, but he just cannot find his way in. Yeah, one thing that people tend to do when they have that second stock in such a big league is they'll throw out, throw out hit boxes to try and finish it out early because you can kind of be a little cavalier. But right. Sonito is just constant pressure, constant pressure until he finally Only really leaving enough. himself for punishes that could potentially, you know, they hit him but not kill him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and that's the thing about it too, but people start playing with that kind of play style. You just have to wait for them to mess up. Yep. You can't be fishing for kill options unless you have confirms. Like if you're a little Mac and you want to go up and start down tilting them, you'd be my guest. Yeah. But as far as Mario, yeah. I'm going to start fishing for grabs and up smash reads. All right, so we're taking this quick to Dreamland. I really like this pick by uh, Big Ox. He can definitely do some damage off the top platform up here. Oh, yeah, absolutely. But he still has to be careful for the uh, Sonic up tilt, up B, I mean, uh, up air, up B, up air. Because that can hurt. I want to see a spring ride, man. <laughs> Let's go. Again, though, Sunita's just being really good with, with what he's doing. No. Right, and the, see, that was a grab punish by Big yeah. Ox. And I feel like the biggest difference between these two players right now is just Sunita's uh, punishes are just like pretty spot on. Yep. Well, Big Ox is missing like two or three that he really needed, and that's why. Oh, that oh. was a great two frame. But um, and that's like the biggest difference in like that's why Sunita's at thirty, Big Ox is at ninety. Yeah. And you know, if you feel like you're good and getting trades in, you're probably just getting less. Yeah. If you notice the percent difference is that, or yeah. you're just not getting the optimal punishes as your opponent. So Big Ox, Big Ox is really fishing. I think he's on tilt a little bit with how it's going. He keeps I mean, the two frame put anybody on tilt. Yeah, absolutely. He can do it to any character. Some easier it's, than others. But yeah, but but yeah, he's he's really fishing for stuff, and I'd like to just see him come in and be a little more confident in the neutral. One thing uh, Mario can do about it, probably, is um, I just want to see if Sonic's going for that two frame, if you up B but don't go for the ledge, like hold down on your tick yeah. so that your up B goes through it. I wonder if that'll trade or if it'll straight up beat it. That's one thing. Uh, one thing Zero Suit can do. Try to get that down air right. Um, her foot on her up B will reach through the ledge and kind of mess up, oh, okay. with, mess with most people uh, who who come through uh, trying to get that two frame. Great. Um, I like that ledge trump. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's what I was say. Reactions, he was insane there. It was the first ledge trump that they oh. got for too. Reads to get up. <sighs> Forward smash finishing out really easily. You're right. 